Hi everyone, it's Palash and uh, in this video I'm going to tell you about the basic requirement for um, drifting easily on a PC um, and it's got something to do with the FPS in your game which is the frames per second so in blur the thing is if you play on a PC um, a modern day PC it will have about 60 FPS and um, for drifting good you really need your game to run at about 30 fps which is the uh, same which is uh, about the same physics as the xbox 360 the 360 runs the game at 30 fps and uh, the game really is made in terms of the 360 and not the pc so it's really really important to run the game at 30 fps to drift properly so you need to have a uh, a frames FPS uh, limiter so I am I'm not a computer expert uh, there might be good softwares for limiting the FPS but the software which I use is something called Bandicam so go ahead and download the software Bandicam once you download and install it uh, you can open it it will be something like this um uh, right now i am recording through rectangle on a screen setting you would have to go to the direct text or open gl window setting right now i can't go because i'm recording it so if you go here it, it will be it will be something like this okay so in this there is an fps tab so go ahead click on it and use this these settings set fps limit and set it to 30 um, and uncheck this only when capturing so it will run your game at 30 fps when you uh, when you start it so once you uh, set your game at 30 fps and then if you try drifting uh, you will notice that it's comparatively easier as compared to 60 fps um, in straight sections you might not see much difference but in tighter tighter turns um, the FPS at 30 really helps I'll, I'll put up a video um, in a week or two showing the difference between 30 FPS and 60 FPS drifting then you will be able to understand it pretty good but in this video I just wanted to show that playing at 30 FPS is the basic requirement to drift properly otherwise you won't be able to drift properly you'll get frustrated and you might give up on drifting and go back to the simple simple racing so i hope this little detail was uh, was n um, sufficient for you guys uh, most of you guys might know this but uh, people who are new to the game uh, i know the game is basically dead but people still buy it and the ones who still are new to the game they might find this uh, information useful so go ahead download this software set your fps to 30 and uh, while you have bandicam on start the game it will automatically limit the fps to 30 and you will enjoy the drifting Anyway, thanks guys for watching. I'll see you next video.